Sussex Royal Instagram, how will Meghan and Harry use their account? Who do they follow? Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have launched their own official Instagram account, and their first joint post is online. What will Harry and Meghan use their account for and who do they follow? The Duke and Duchess of Sussex now have an official Instagram in a break away from Prince William and Kate's Kensington Palace account. Named at Sussex Royal, their new venture is the latest in the number of major changes for the royal couple. Not only is Meghan expected to give birth this month, but they are moving into a new property in Windsor. Their new residence is at Frogmore Cottage in the idyllic Windsor countryside, and they will arrive sometime within the next few weeks after extensive renovations are completed. Meghan and Harry's Instagram will be another avenue for the Duke and Duchess to show their work in the royal family. The official nature of the account means it will be run by employees on their behalf so those hoping to gain insight into the couple's personal life will be disappointed. However, the Instagram account will give the public more of an insight into Meghan and Harry's work. In their first post, the couple stated exactly what they would be using their Instagram for. They wrote, Welcome to our official Instagram, we look forward to sharing the work that drives us, the causes we support, important announcements, and the opportunity to shine a light on key issues. We thank you for your support and welcome you to at Sussex Royal. Harry and Meghan are officially following some 23 other accounts on the site. Meghan and Harry's followed accounts are carefully picked out to reflect their work. Among the people they follow are the Duke of York, Kensington Palace and Princess Eugenie. The other accounts are the Duke and Duchess official charities and endorsements, including the Invitus Games in England Rugby. The account and the move to Frogmore House mark a bid for independence for both Meghan and Harry as they prepare to welcome baby Sussex. Their move establishes a new royal household separate of Kensington Palace, which they once shared with William and Kate. This means the Duke and Duchess are enlisting a new team of employees to assist them in running their day-to-day -day life. Hillary Clinton's former campaign adviser Sarah Latham has already joined on as communications secretary for Harry and Meghan. Their staff will still report back to the Queen's employees at Buckingham Palace, so they won't be entirely separate. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to get instant news update.